I'm Ro Khan, and this is the Ro Report, around your world right now. Even though First Lady Michelle Obama is back home from her glitzy vacation in Spain, anger continues to mount. Former Bush advisor Karl Rove tells Fox News Channel's Bill O'Reilly, this, this, this is going to do long-term damage to the image of this president. Now, he may have a point, because on the same week the government announced the loss of 131,000 jobs, the First Lady was soaking up sun on private beaches and lunching with royalty during a five-day trip. And the cost to you and me, the taxpayer? More than $350,000. And we didn't even get a postcard. Super genius and physicist Stephen Hawking believes that to survive long term, humans must leave Earth. This guy's really starting to worry me. Just last month, he suggested we time travel into the future and avoid extraterrestrials because they might want to hurt us. You know, the problem with being a genius is no one can understand him anyway. So if he really did go nuts, how would we ever know? Embattled Congressman Charlie Rangel takes to the floor of the House to proclaim his innocence. All I'm saying is I deserve and demand the right to be heard. And he told his fellow Democrats, no matter how hot it gets in the kitchen, he's not getting out before the election in November. I am not going away. I am here. Merry Christmas, Republicans. <laughs> the World Sauna Championships in Finland took a turn for the tragic when one of the two finalists died trying to sweat out the heat. Both Vladimir Lajenski and his opponent, reigning champ Timo Kakonin, collapsed during the final round as temperatures rose above 200 degrees. They remained in the sauna unconscious for more than six minutes until judges pulled them out. Lajenski was pronounced dead on the scene, and his opponent was then awarded the championship. You know when they say winning isn't everything? This is one case where it is. And finally, Julia Roberts has converted to Hinduism. She claims she discovered the religion while in India, filming the spiritual memoir, Eat, Pray, Love, which opens in theaters today. Everybody has a moment in their life where you need to redefine who you are and what you're looking for. Now, Ms. Roberts, you are aware that reincarnation is for people and not careers, right? And now you've heard it all, people. I'm Ro Khan, and this has been The Row Report.